All right, guys, welcome back. Today, we're going to be playing an all-new horror game called Grief, a short horror experience. I've got a small problem with this game. I mean, you just boot it up, and it just it says start. It doesn't give me a picture, you know, something to kind of illustrate what's about to happen. It doesn't give me options. It's like telling me to jump off a cliff, but you're not, you're not illustrating it for me. Am I going to be jumping off into a pile of rocks? Am I going to be jumping into a mattress, into a, a bubble, into the water? A am I going to break a leg? Am I going to die? Like, you play as Lucius Mannings, a father of an only child named Jessica. However, a series of strange occurrences are in the midst that the public has deemed the events. However, officials from a nearby asylum assure all residents that nothing odd is in the works. Attention, this game contains flashing lights. All right, well, there's no going back now. To get close to objects to interact, push doors to open, and shift to run. Oh God, the fact that we've got a running button in this game, I, it's already a big fat no, okay? So, I'm assuming push the big red button. Yes, that's, all right. All I did was June 22 of 2015, the night of the events. Ugh, I cannot wait to be home and see my daughter after a tough day at work. She has been acting kind of weird lately. Okay, so I'm assuming this is my house. So like I literally work right there <laughs> and my house is right here. It's like 20 seconds away. Okay. That's that's kind of interesting. Um, okay, so I'm assuming I've got to press the keypad. Oh. The window. Okay, what? No. Oh, come on, dude. Are you kidding me? We are literally less than a minute into this game. Jessica? Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure you've already confirmed that I've arrived. You can close the window now. You know, you don't have to just stay there. Oh, God. Oh, and the door's open. That's fucking great. Like, hey, Dad, come inside. Not, not, it's weird. She, you see? She left the door open. Jessica? Jessica, I'm going to be saying that a lot today, okay? Uh, she's probably gone off with her friends again. She never tells me these things anymore. That damn teenagers. Oh, okay. Breaking news. Because of what some citizens are calling the event, asylum workers are being forced to the streets of Bergsville. The event has caused some residents to become mentally confused, leading them to aimlessly roam the streets. Asylum employees report odd screams and pleas coming from those affected. No one knows the cause of the event, but the asylum promises to work it out. Asylum, meanwhile, a young girl, age 17, has been affected by the event. However, she somehow managed to break free of the asylum officials. They are hunting her down at this moment to restore justice to the neighbors. So close up your doors and windows and keep safe, residents, because this is going to be one. Un 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 oh God, uh, I think I should go upstairs and go to bed now since Jessica is probably out with her friends after all. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that, there's somebody upstairs. I don't think that's a good idea, pal. Oh, shit. Jessica? Honey? I'm home. Oh, God. Okay, this is my bed. Right? Is this my bed? That's, that's, okay. Yep, that's my bed. Going to bed. Everything's okay. Just had a hard day at work, that's all. Jessica? Oh god, are you fucking kidding me? My own daughter's gonna kill me. Hold on, what is this? Main debug mode, no signal. Alright. 
It's totally fine. What is that? What does that even say? Go to hell? What? Is that what that says? Or am I just making that up? All right, Jesse. You're starting to freak daddy out, okay? What the fuck? Wait, what just happened? Hold on, let me check the doors. Okay. There's no way that's my daughter. Please don't tell me that's my daughter. Okay, that's a dead body. 100% Kafo! Whoa! What? What just happened? Okay. We're going back upstairs. Or actually, possibly, maybe downstairs. No. Into the laundry? Nobody here? Okay. You know what? This is... This is all just one big nightmare. I'm gonna go back upstairs and... I'm just gonna go to bed. Alright? Oh, whoa, whoa, this is new. Whoa, okay. This isn't part of my house. Okay, so apparently we've got a secret stash. That we had no idea about. That's, that's always nice. I'm just gonna keep following the doors here. We've got a key. Perfect. Excellent. Alright, so I'm assuming this key. Oh, we're locked in here. Shit. Okay. Hold on. Hey, what? Hi! Give me a flashlight. Oh. Bro, what is happening in this game? This game is playing with me right now. God damn it, Jessica! There's no way this is real. This has got to be a damn nightmare. I mean, we went to sleep and all of a sudden woke up and we're experiencing all these... ...sorts of events. This is going to be an ongoing... Uh, yep, this is going to be a loop. I can already see it. Uh, so predictable. I'm sorry to break it to you, Jess, but your mind games, <laughs> they're just not quite working on me. You, you understand? Okay, so we don't have a door here now. Just keep going. Follow the hallway. Oh. Okay. Whoa, what? What is that? What does that even say? Oh, what the fuck is that? No, I'm not. No, not doing it. Jessica! Oh. Bro, she was... Ah! Okay, Dad doesn't know that I'm affected by the event. I'm afraid he's gonna hit me again. Whoa, what? The key... This key is used to lock the coffin. Ah! Yo! Lock that bitch up! Sorry. That's, that's my daughter. What, what am I saying? She's a good girl. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Jess. Oh, God. This is horrible. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, no, God. Not, not those flash events. Nope. Don't give... Bro, that's a creepy picture. All right, these are all dead bodies. Yo, am I the crazy one? Could I be the one that's going crazy? By the way, let, let's just, let me just get this out of the way. This said... Stop. <laughs> the game said it was a short horror experience. A short horror experience is like 5, 10 minutes max. And we, we've been at this for a pretty long. Fuck, that picture is creepy. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, God. Jessica. Jessica. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, bro, this game is intense. Um... Okay, we're back home. What? I am not going downstairs. I am sorry. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go downstairs. I'm gonna be a brave boy. I'm gonna be brave. Everything's gonna be okay! Oh, thank God. It was just a dream. I hope Jessica's home. Uh, I'm sorry to break it to you, pal, but that, that was not just a dream. I think... I think we're fucked. We're gonna die. And, uh... Yeah. Okay, maybe... It, see, it was a dream. Okay. Alright. Perfect. That's just... A pantry, or... As the figure got away. In other news, little has been revealed about last night's event. Asylum officials are denying any wrongdoings. They said some sort of bug going around that should leave the area soon. An angry mob of residents led a boycott today due to the sudden departure of their family members to the asylum. The officials won't release information on what happened next. They are still looking for that 17-year-old girl. She's oh. been described as having long black hair, has a normal body size, and is normally seen smiling for an unknown reason. If you have any information about her, dial... Don't work Okay. Just remember to keep safe, residents. Alright, can you shut up already? Stop! Okay, it's still 9.59. What, what the hell's going on here? I arrived home at 9.59. Somebody was eating pizza here. I need to find Jessica now. Jessica? Okay, so we're not going outside. We're gonna stay inside the house. Maybe she's in her room, in, in, in her TV room. In the basement! Oh! God! I hope. Okay, where... How do I... Why is there like a random light there? I don't like that. Hold on. How do I open up? Okay, here we go. Perfect. Huh? I've never seen the basement this clean before. A ladder that goes down? I do not remember having this. Uh, this is the most odd fucking basement I've ever seen. Oh god, am I really gonna have to go down there? I mean, isn't it bad enough I'm already in the basement? Oh. Yo, what? Uh <laughs> I'm okay, I'm fine. That just... Nothing happened, you just... <laughs> just scared the shit out of me. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Jessica? Listen, if you've been partying out for too long with your friends, I'm gonna have to cut that cord, alright? It's not happening anymore. Out on my watch. You irresponsible little twerp. Jesse. Come on. Please don't tell me you're the crazy little 17 year old girl that's been possessed. Not you. Not my daughter. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Oh, God. Everything is so plain and so just basic that it's so creepy. Now, I, I haven't been able to run this whole entire time, so I don't know what the hell they gave me a sprint button for. All right, I've got the key. Now that's going to be the key to, to the, 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 can't even talk right now. The, the door in the main hallway, the front, straight ahead. That's the key. Okay. Oh, God. Hello? God damn it. Everything is so quiet. All I hear is static. The short horror experience has been, has, has been going on for too long now, man. I need to end this crap. Okay. Jessica's lounging area. Girls only. I guess I'm going to have to make an exception to that rule. What the fuck? <laughs> Girls only, Dad. Don't you dare come in here. Okay. Sorry, sweetheart. Oh, okay. Hold on. What's going on? Okay. 
Yo, what the fuck? No. What is that? That's an entire neck. I'm gonna go in between the... Okay, hold on. Everything's fine. This is exactly like the last room. What's going on here? Jessica? What are you what are you girls up to down here? Huh? Oh god. Not playing spin the bottle down here, huh? You guys have, you guys have any boys down here, would you? Because if you do, I'm gonna kill them all, you understand? Okay. What is going on? Jessica? Bro, can we get a Jessica counter in this video? Seriously. <laughs> Alright, those are just... You were hanging from... Okay. Alright, listen up, y'all. I don't know what type of fucking game you teenagers got going on here, but it doesn't fly not on my watch. What is this? What are you guys playing here? Huh? It's not Fortnite? What is that? This is a strange game, bro. I don't know if it's a dream, a nightmare, or reality. Well, it's definitely not a dream. <laughs> Dreams are supposed to be nice. And uh, colorful and shit, you know? Ah. Uh I think we're the one with the problem, honestly. Lock him up. He knows. <laughs> what? What? Prisoner 624. A. Okay, so it's to be dealt with and threatened with extreme and treated with extreme caution. The subject has a bizarre mental state due to the case of both. PTSD and schizophrenia. Although he has been instructed numerous times, he still denies our medication. He claims that he is real and, it's, um, and is coming to get us. The facility doesn't know what this could mean. Do not believe anything that this individual states um, that is true. Nine days before he was found in his home, it has been speculated that the individual has murdered his own daughter, Jessica Mannings, in order to please him. According to the individual, Numerous children were also found inside the basement of the individual's home communicating with strangers online by just breathing. Whoa, dude. I knew it. According to the individual, okay, so numerous children were also found inside the basement of this individual's home communicating with strangers online. By just breathing. Subject name Lucius Manning. Wow. Dude, this was pretty incredible. Like very basic. Um, it had a couple of jump scares, but overall the entire time and maybe you I felt uneasy as hell. Like I didn't know when something was gonna happen and when it wasn't. It was really well done. And then just the cherry on top, this note basically confirming that we were just not right in the head. We killed our own daughter. And these were just visions that we were having. Or so at least the game is making it seem that way. Wow. That was incredible. Guys, if you enjoyed it, drop it a like. Thank you for watching. And, um, yeah. <laughs> All right.